Over the years, researchers have discovered some incredible ancient relics of the past. These have been able to give us a glimpse into what life would have been like thousands of years ago. Although discredited by scientists all over the world, stories can be found about giants. Over the last 100 years, stories about giants have come from the Solomon Islands. Researchers have discovered old tales from the native people there. The Solomon Islands are located in the South Pacific, and a man named Marius is a researcher who was told about tales of giants while on the island. After asking around, the locals began to tell him stories. Incredibly, the natives spoke of giants that stood over 10 feet tall, while others shared stories of giants that reached even greater heights. The descriptions of the giants share a common theme. They're believed to have long reddish hair, protruding double eyebrows, bulging red eyes, flat noses, and a wide gaping mouth. These stories have even reached newspapers. However, as of today, they're just stories, and without incredible proof, they remain just that. But there is one place that allegedly has proof of giants. There is a place in Laos known as the Plain of Jars and for good reason. When arriving here, you see thousands of giant jars. What's interesting about these is the fact that some of these jars are between one and three meters high, and also having a diameter of two to three meters. These incredible structures are made completely out of stone, and they date back to the Iron Age. As you can imagine, many have put forward questions to why they're so big. They are far too large for any modern human to carry, so what use would they have? It's one of the biggest and most important prehistoric sites in Southeast Asia. Researchers have established that some of these stones weigh over several tons. Most of these structures are made of sandstone, but there are others that are made of harder granite and limestone. Researchers who analyzed the stones come forward and said that these giant jars would have been manufactured with a degree of knowledge of what materials and techniques were suitable. It's thought that their creators used iron chisels to manufacture them. However, this is just a theory as no conclusive evidence for this exists. Incredibly, not much is known about who made these giant jars, meaning that little is known about their origins or purpose. According to some of the local legends, the jars were created by a race of giants, whose king needed somewhere to store his rice wine. This wine was believed to have been consumed at a great feast. For now, these giant jars remain a mystery, and we can only theorize what they were used for thousands of years ago. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more videos.